of the debris channel. Are you playing this off of? Yes. Um, tonight I just came out and just played. I felt like the last game um, helped me out, like, building up my confidence. Every game I'm just trying to like, continue to build up my confidence. You're still surprised a little bit the teams are fix, so fixated on Asia that they're continuing to leave you guys that open out there in the perimeter? Um, no, not really. Uh, you know, Asia is one of the best, you know, host players in the country. So, you know, people, teams are going to come in, you know, trying everything possible to stop her. And, you know, just trying to see if, you know, we're going to hit shots. You know, with Asia, when you give Asia the ball, nine times out of ten, you know, she's going to, do something productive with either score, get the basket, whatever it may be. So, you know, most teams are probably just saying, well, I hope, you know, me, Crystal, you know, Bria, Brooke, you know, whoever, the guards, they're going to hope that we're off. So, I, I'm not surprised at all. Is it motivation for you? Is it a Yeah, it is motivation, um, you know, and it takes a lot of pressure. You know, we're just trying to take more pressure off of Asia, you know. The more, you know, we're playing better, play, playing well, you know, teams won't fixate on her too much, you know, every game, you know, they're just trying to stop her, but, you know, if we're hitting shots, you know, we're playing with confidence, then it'll help her in the paint, and they won't play on her, you know, double, triple, or team her as much. You think you as guards were better this day as far as not trying to force it in there than the last time? Times we're trying to force it in. Yeah, um, you know, it's frustrating for her. So, you know, as her teammates, we, we we try to get her the ball as much as possible because, you know, we understand that it, it gets frustrating, you know, when you have the whole team basically on you. So, you know, we just try to move the ball a little more as the guards create so we can try to pull some more defense off of her. But, you know, teams like that are just going to, you know, if we don't really have a strong post player to guard her, they're going to do that all game. on this Mount Vernon, New York day here today between <laughs> you and Gertia. Yeah. Nice to see her. Yeah, it was nice. It's pretty well. Have you, have you known her most of your life? Or? Um, yeah, I met Bert when she was like in the seventh, eighth grade. Um, so I've known her for a while. And we played high school together when I was at Mount Vernon. So um, I've known her for a while. So she would have been a freshman when you were a senior. Yeah, and I was in 10th grade, so she, yeah, I played with her. She was on the team when she was, like, in the 7th grade, I think it was. So, I mean, she didn't play as much, but, you know, I've known her. Lately. Did she talk to you when she was considering coming here? Um, yeah, she talked to me a little bit. Um, so, you know, she's always interested, and, you know, I would tell her about the team and, you know, how we play. So. What's finals week like for you when I mean, you get the tests and all that going on you're still trying to get ready for Marshall at the end of the year. So. Um, you know, school comes first. You know, you, you have to focus and you have to, you know, make your grades or you can't play, you know. So I just feel like, you know, everyone just has to focus on, you know, getting the grades that they're supposed to get and, you know, doing what you're supposed to do in the court. I mean, this is just a, a year-round thing. You know, this is every year. You have to perform in the classroom and on the court. So there's nothing new. Anything else for Taylor?